Hey, what's going on everyone? This is Akadash here. <clears throat> Welcome back to uh, Half-Life. Hmm. Oh, hold up. That's not a garage door opener. I, I mentioned that because... Were you there this whole time? Um, and I just didn't notice you for some reason. Uh, but yeah, last episode I had ended with, like, thinking, oh, it's a garage door opener, or whatever, but... Anyway, this lowered that. Oh, I think I see... I believe I see what I'm supposed to do. I wonder if I can interact with this. Nope. Okay, so this... Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, so we got in the midst of a little bit of an alien versus the United States military conflict. And it seems both sides are uh, quite formidable for each other, so... Which I... I, I really like it when, you know, when the U.S. military or the, you know, Earth military is, like, at least formidable for, like, the, for, like, an alien invasion or something. Just kind of a, whoop. Um. Which, you know, makes me think of, like, Something about Warhammer 40,000, or 40k, um, that, like, although I don't really like the Imperium very much because, you know, they're pretty, you know, I mean, you know, there are some folks in there that are far less evil, like, they're kind of anti-hero, I guess, um, you know, um, but, like, but yeah, the Imperium itself is just, like, you know, very evil. Um, but, I mean, you know, there's pretty much, there's almost no, like, actual hero, uh, or, you know, almost no good guys in, 40, in 40k. Um, but, uh, that's beside the point. The thing about 40k that does make me smile rather smugly to myself, though, is that it is one of the only, um, the only sci-fi franchises, whoops, wrong button, it is one of the only sci-fi franchises where when the humans show up, then everybody starts panicking, <laughs> basically. Um, it's, it's just because, yeah, you know, it's just always, uh, it's, it's just a sci classic sci-fi trope of, like, yo, the humans are always outmatched, and, you know, the humans are always the one that, ones that are panicking, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Okay, I think I am actually supposed to open this door because... Okay, hold up. So that's why I need to raise that thing. Okay. For a minute there, I was thinking to myself, wait, so is this just a purely interactive thing? Just serves no purpose? Ooh. It's another one of 
of these. You know, I look at these things and they kind of look like little, little ghost wormy thingamabobbers. It's too bad I don't have a reticle whenever I man these things. <laughs> yeah, they they still coming. Oh lord, they coming. Not anymore though. Oh, wrong button. I always press like a. I tend to press escape after finishing up with one of these things because I just kind of expect that to work. But no, it never does. Yeah, uh, the weapons those uh, alien brute guys use, which is like this organic arm cannon thingamabobber, the projectiles, which are like, you know, shows like a rocket, um, when they zip past, like, they, they tend to, like, fly all around, like, they have the very unruly, uh, patterns, uh, flight patterns and such, which makes me, which is why this thing reminds me of the, the Needler from Halo, as I mentioned before. Uh, but when they zip past me or zip near me, they sound like bees. So I'm actually kind of wondering, like, is, is that actually the projectile? Is it like some kind of bug weapon? Because I do have another sort of bug we I do have a bug weapon, these things, like, bas they're basically like the <clears throat> like, uh, crawling grenades, I guess. Um, like, they'll just go and seek prey. <clears throat> so, yeah. Just, uh, it's, it's, it's a little cute. It's actually kind of a little cute in its own way. Mostly ugly and gross, but it's uh, still a little cute. Uh oh. Let them fight. Yeah, see? They sound like bugs. Whoop. Ow. One got me. Wow. They took him out. Stay out of sight. I, I always love moments like this in games where you just show up and they're like different entities fighting each other. Ow. Okay. Still found me. Alright, well I have a solution for this. Uh, which is why one of my <coughs> one of my favorite moments in uh, Metroid Prime 2 is when uh, it's like the the part right before the second uh, Dark Samus fight, which is where. Um, You, uh, it's like you, you bust open this, uh, power bomb door, and you come in, and you see a bunch of dark pirates shooting at something, and then you come in closer, and you realize that they're shooting at Dark Samus, and then Dark Samus just does this one big charge attack and just kills them all, like, just like that, and, uh, then does this, like, evil laugh and stuff. 
like this scary evil laugh. Oops. But yeah, that's such a cool part. So it seems regardless, they're gonna be able to see me. Right behind you, you weirdo. Didn't, I didn't mean to fall down like that. Oh, howdy, neighbor. I forgot about you. A brute. Okay. Here's a cool gun. I still don't know what it's called. So, I guess I'll just sort of refer to it as my ray gun or something. Or my cannon. Ray cannon. I don't know. Oops. <laughs> I'll say I don't know which way is the correct way. Anyway. Um... They sound really close. Woo! Maybe this is the side room, not the progression room. Yep, 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 yep. Ooh. Uh. At 98. I'll save that one. I don't suppose I can break this. Nope. battery. Hmm. More tranquilizer darts. Am I full? I guess so, yeah. yeah boxes on shelves never have anything. Which is a little bit of a shame, but, uh... Oh well. They are hard to get to, anyway. All right, let's go ahead and arm ourselves with this one. Okay. No, you made me miss, you, you jerk. I'm so bad, I know. All right, that's what you get. <clears throat> Oh, did he just kick him through there? Ouch. Let's 
Too little, too late, I'm afraid. I'm, I'm really enjoying this game. I, I, I really like it. Alright, looks like it's time to bring in the old, uh, the old cannon. Ow! Yeah, I'm convinced those are bugs. He's launching at me. <clears throat> sure, I'll go back for, uh... Ah! Alright, you know what? not gonna worry about it because you know what oh <laughs> okay It's one of these boun bouncy thingies. Gosh, darn it. I didn't mean to do that. I don't know. I was checking to see if he uh, had anything I needed. Probably, uh, that'll open up. Oh, hey! Did I hear my name? Hold still, my guy. Thank you. Also, I appreciate that the laser physics are very accurate in that it's like immediate I beg your pardon how about I don't do that you know what's this do nothing gonna keep throwing grenades at me, okay. Alright. Two can play at that game. Uh, hold on. Oh! I think it's too high. Yep, it's too high. Well, in that case... Let's go, uh... Ablazing. Aw, oh, man, that could've been... That could've been epic. Why is your gun sinking? You know what, that's not important.
You know what, I'm gonna try that one more time. <clears throat> no. Gosh darn it. No! I'm trying to one-shot him. It's not working. Oh, I could have just... I could have just left him alone. Yes! Wait. I lost health, though. <laughs> oh, <laughs> well, that's what I get for gloating. <laughs> okay. All right, he's gonna throw a grenade. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <clears throat> uh, well, let's explore this rooftop a little bit more. Well, that's why I heard another one of those guys. He was right on that rooftop. Shall we? Maybe. Oh. Why am I missing so badly? I th okay, well. Alright, well. That's what I get for relying on auto target. Unless these guys have just gotten stronger. I swear they've been taking more than they took more than two shots. Oh! Oh wait, that didn't even hurt me. I don't think. But that did. Hey, I don't know what this does! Oh, it does that. Yo. Oh. It's <laughs> literally all that does. I got more pistol ammo. Yeah, I forget that. Oops. I forget that, um. You can get pistol ammo from, uh. From, uh, soldiers. Okay. Let's try this again, shall we? Alright, let's go. I 
I don't have that many, okay. Another one of them guards. Stand back. Whoa, hey, 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 hey. Hello. Okay, we might live longer if we work together. Yeah, I'll wait here. I wonder. Would he actually have shot me if I stand back? Hello. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Possibly. Just because I never do that. I never do this. Well, actually, I was supposed to do that anyway. Thanks, bud. Oh, yeah, I'm on the other side of this now. Yep. Whoop. Fun That's funny. I was just thinking about you because I uh, ran into one of your buddies over there. Lost to the quick draw, my friend. <clears throat> Whoa! Gosh darn it. Hey, uh, guardy old boy. I may need you again. Just had to clear the area first, you know? Okay, I'll cover you. Just in case you're afraid of the dark. Also, please don't... Don't jump on that trampoline. It dangerous, fam. This place is a lot bigger than I thought. Yep. Hmm, using, using it when with your gun hand. The guy responsible for this mess. Uh, let's save on the other side of this. <laughs> I was like, I've heard that noise before. What is that? Yeah. This is a pickle. Maybe I can destroy it, though. I'll uh, take that as a no, then.
Uh, Versum. Help! Oh, hold up. You lose interest already, buddy. Ah! Okay. Let's just have the claymores. Uh, oh, I only have five. Well, maybe I can only carry five at a time. Thankfully, he doesn't have, like, really any long-range, like, blaster-type weapons or anything of that nature. Ah! Help! The six are made! Let's try this again, shall we? I think they may just slow him down, like they don't actually hurt him. I mean, you know, naturally, anyway. Also, let's try and space these out a little bit. This is probably a bad idea. Oh! <laughs> he said before injuring himself with his own darn claymore. I know. I'll quick save before I place all the claymores. Oh boy. Never mind. again. Why weren't those going off? Help! Okay, you know what? I'm just not going to place these claymores. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. They seem to slow them down a little bit, but then some of those weren't even going off for some reason. 
Also, part of why I assumed that I was kind of supposed to be using some claymores is because, well, when I was first introduced to the claymores was the first time I encountered one of those things. So, you know, I was trying to put two and two together like a good video game player. Huh. Weird, this one isn't automatically launching me. This didn't really look like what I was, uh, where I was supposed to go, uh, anyway, so. It's awfully quiet here. Oh, there's finally some sound here. I was expecting a great big fight with a big room like this. But, uh, nothing doing, Sam. Oh, hold up. Oh, oh that's just, that's just ambience. This kind of looks like there's uh, some sort of fishy thing down here, you know? Or that there might be, anyway. Or, or not. And... nope. He's right there. And this is... A map of where I am? Is it? Yeah, sure looks like it. So where am I exactly? So I don't accidentally bomb myself. Ah! I see where I am. Okay, this is a cool puzzle. Um... Okay, he is... Right... Right about there. And then... out there? Let's try that. All right. Yeah, they, they have like the the ways to destroy those things like yeah, pretty cool ways. And the first one was, you know, just ramming him with a train. Uh just for kicks, I'm going to actually blow myself up. <laughs> this just, just just cause, you know. 
Um, I'm here, yeah? Alright. Blow me up! Oh. So that's why there's some health packs up here, just, just in case I <coughs> do that. Let's try that. Haha! I did it! <laughs> I'm a moron! Okay. <laughs> no. Anyway. <clears throat> Ah, so this is why the water is there. Genius. Okay, it's too bad we couldn't salvage that bad boy. So... Now what? Where do I go from here? Oh, I, I think I know where. Not there. Probably gotta go where the big robo thingy-mabobber came from. I'll definitely be adding some music and stuff, probably some good old Kevin McLeod stuff since it's very fitting. Um, because this game, boy oh boy, this game is very quiet, it can be very quiet at times. Um, plus, it like it does have some music, but the music doesn't always, like it's not always there, you know. further. Oh. Wrong thing anyway. thought so. Um, it doesn't seem to be a way I can get over there, though. So. Okay, this is still on the Y. It's still on the Y. Uh, on the Y axis right there. Yeah, still good, I would say. So, in that case... Try that. Nope. Too far. Oh, what? I seem to go even further away. 
So the water moat there and the ladder, it's like, you know, because it suggests that the player will fall in at some point. And why would he fall in? Probably well, because he's trying to hop something. Anyway, um, I don't know if the rest of this wall can be destroyed, but... They can. They can. Okay. All right. Uh, let's try this. Try knocking out this corner. I do like me a uh, good airstrike, you know. All right. The y-axis is fine. Whoops. Wrong button. Oh, dang it. Yeah. Let's try that. That seemed a little... I'm not sure I can destroy that, uh, that section right there. Oh. Oh. Are you serious? Um... Oh, not again. Let me try that some more. Just can't make that. Hold on. Is there a bridge that extends from that? You think? Perhaps I can make a bridge. Hmm. 
<clears throat> nope, nothing doing. Um, whoops. Secrets. I can't make that jump. Maybe if I had the, uh, that jet thingy. Hold on. That's too far, but... Though it would be close enough... <laughs> I just had to do that. All right. Um, is that right? Not quite. Nice. Love it. Okay, I'll stop. Okay. <laughs> There's the lambda. Forget about Freeman. <clears throat> Wasn't that what the guy on the radio was saying? You know, we're moving out. Forget about Freeman, we're moving out. <clears throat> exactly am I supposed to do about that? <laughs> what the? Oh, that's blocked off. So I gotta figure my figure a way out of this, or... get on top um, but uh... 
Yeah, plot twist, this is actually the end of the game. <laughs> no, um... Mm. What do I do? Just gonna ruminate that on that with a sip of coffee. With cinnamon, by the way. Forget about Freeman, we are call calling our losses and pulling out. What did that do? Oh! I didn't mean to do that! I'm sorry! See you later. Yep, there's the brute. Oh, wrong weapon. I forgot I quick saved there. Oh, gosh darn it, one of them got me. Ugh. Overkill. <laughs>
get you, uh... Oh, we can't. Where'd he go? Oh. Well, I thought of I thought of going back in there and activating the turret, and, or getting him in here, and then activating the turret. But then the turret would also fire at him, and I also realized it would also fire at me as well. Okay, I'll secure this. Hmm. Don't mind if I do. The boys are making like Emperor Minx and getting out. Hmm. Ain't working. Signal the fleet. We are moving out now. The heck is that? Ah, so that is what I was supposed to do. I guess. Great, now we got uh, some fleshly. I just realized what I was looking at. I'll blow up eventually. It's a little sad, really. No. Oh. Medkit. Figures. You know, it's a place I can get some health if I so desire. Those guys kind of sound like they're saying die sometimes. Ah! Okay, note to self. Reload this first. Lock and load. All right, get these boys' attention. What a waste of ammo. Let's try that again, shall we, gentlemen? Out there, all right. Plus, that guy was like at point blank range, and he still survived the first shot. So, you know. Fall in the water. Mm. 
Not exactly. Stay safe, my guard buddy over there. Hi! How do you do? Not very well, apparently. Oh, that's a turret. Right, right, right. The red lasers. Or the red laser. But it'll still activate if I get... If I touch it. So... I do have to be mindful of that. Woo! Gosh! Darn it, you! Son of a... <clears throat> well, in that case... Aha! Joke's on you! Aren't you guys supposed to be pulling out? Can I leap through that? Probably. That's oh, another one of those boys. I missed you. Not really. Oh, howdy, neighbor. Hey, those guys were particularly resilient. Okay, so this does look like a, a leaperoo sort of a thing. Yeah, let's keep that. Ah, uh, this is a. Nope. Got it. Really make you pull some fancy tricks in this game, huh? Got some music again. There's a lot of water. I'm a, I'm a little, gosh. I was just about to say something about you. Oh. I was just about to say, man, there's a lot of water. I'm pretty sure I'm going to run into another one of those fish things. Particularly since the game gave me more tranquilizer darts earlier, so, you know, that indicate that 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 indicates to me, you know, okay, I'm going to I'm gonna fight one of those fish monsters again. Oh, that got me. That got me good. Alright, I'm a bit more prepared. It's still gonna be scary, but I'm a bit more prepared. Reload, damn you! For some reason, it wasn't, uh... Hang on. Pardon my language, I was just panicking a little bit. 
Oh, I see. Yeah. Okay. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Okay. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay. <sighs> oh, my heart. Anyway. Oh, bye. <laughs> Nothing personal. I just don't like you. Of course, I could just let it pull me up. And then I'll just whack it once with my uh, crowbar. And that actually, you know, one hits, one hits them. Or one shot. Ah, I see. Fire damage. Rude. Ah, the steam. Oh, lovely. More turrets. Four sentries. Oh, thank you. Really, you shouldn't have. Oh, pfft. God, gone it. It's just one grenade, but my perfectionist side is taking is taking over. Aha! Well, that didn't even do anything anyway. Rockets. Lots of rockets. Hmm. I find that concerning. Oh, that's only one at a time, anyway. I was like, uh, did I, uh... That's what's hitting me. 
Like when the game gives you a bunch of ammo and health. Frickity doo da, frickity day. Ow! Well, I guess there's not really much I can do about that. Alright, let's uh, arm this. Okay, so we can swap Q. I don't use Q very often in this game. It's really too bad because it could really be a. Uh, uh, hey, um. Oh! Gosh. Oh, he, he was already dead. Gosh, darn it. That sound is really piercing. Oh, howdy, neighbor. Hey! You're not supposed to run away. Wait a minute. I've got a... I took care of him, yeah? Oh, pfft, gosh darn it! <laughs> of course it doesn't always work. Got it! I beg your pardon. Emergency Ah. I see. Can I squeeze by you? Ah! You sure can, but that doesn't mean it's gonna be pleasant on the other side. Arguably, this is not how you play Half-Life, but you know what? You give me the quick save option and the quick load option, I will do it. <laughs> so in that sense, this is how you play Half-Life. Sounds like I'm getting close to some radioactive material. Yep. Well, this seems like a good place to stop. Um, boy oh boy. Forget about Freeman indeed. Um, yeah. Uh, thank you all so much for watching. As always, God bless, and I hope to see you next time for some more Half-Life. Ooh. I wonder how much left is in this game. This has already been, what, 12, 13 hours or something so far? It's a good, it's a good long game. Anyway.
Ciao.